Good evening, you guys. So welcome to day 12, 13 of being quarantined. Here in Minnesota, we are actually today, Friday, is the first day of everything being um, no shelter, no shelter. So today is the first day at midnight that we're at no shelter. Austin got a haircut from Ethan yesterday. He actually did a really good job. Um, so many things have been happening. I haven't picked up the camera because Ethan and I have actually been doing a lot of like TikTok challenges. Mm -hmm. We did a koala challenge. We did, I don't know what that one's even called, if it has a name, but um, it was, it's really fun. Austin has been helping us because we're old and we don't know how to do TikTok. Mm -hmm. So we need these kids to help us. Um, I'll leave all, all of our TikToks below if you want to follow us. Well, they'll be, Austin has a TikTok, Nevaeh has a TikTok, and I have a TikTok. Nevaeh so, Nevaeh is slowly beating Austin in TikTok. So, follow us, follow us all. Okay, so we've been talking about this for, if you follow me on Instagram, you've probably seen me talk about this, but we are talking, we've been talking about ripping up the carpet downstairs and getting flooring, like uh, vinyl flooring. And we actually pulled the trigger today, which I'm really glad we did. It gives my husband something to do because he is very, um, he is a busy body boy. He cannot sit and not do anything. So Ethan found a crazy, crazy deal on Facebook. He is like a Facebook a Craigslist guru, I like to call him, because he finds the best deals in the world. So the flooring altogether that we bought would have cost us $1,600. However, he got it for half the price, literally almost half the price. So I'm gonna show you guys. Um, he cleaned the carpets last night and then now he just ripped them all up. But if you guys remember Winston, our dog that we bought, we had um, for a little bit, we had him for about a year. We ended up rehoming him, but he peed all over our downstairs, literally everywhere. And so Grayson has had, has been having allergies to it. Um, whenever he's downstairs, we've noticed he, his skin breaks out. He gets very sneezy and we do not have any mold anywhere. We have checked. We have done the whole thing. My dad does, um, home inspections for his job. So we've checked all those out and I'm like, all the people are going, no, I think it's the carpet. And so we're like, you know what? We should just rip it out. So here we go. <laughs> Ethan already has ripped out all the carpet. You guys would not believe the ants we had. Right, Eve? Yeah. So yeah, so we ripped out the tile here and this is where all the ants were. And this is, this corner and this corner is where Winnie pooped every or pooped pee peed everywhere. He peed so these everywhere. two, these two corners, and this is where Peanut, this is her puking spot. Or in there. So the the flooring we got is waterproof and it has the cushion on it. You were saying. It's already got the underlayment because normally when you put put this down on concrete floor in the basement, sometimes you got to put a moisture barrier down first. Yeah. So the basement floods. This comes with an under like a rubber underlayment already. Peed, I don't so. know it's like the best stuff. I'm gonna probably do a time lapse of you guys actually like laying it. But you have to, yeah. Did you say that last piece of carpet was nasty? Is that what you were saying to me, whispering? I mean, some of like that, this whole, pulling this piece here, anything around here. Yep. It was puking in the corner and all the dogs pee on the edge. Like I just saw stain upon stain upon stain. Yeah. And just all the dirt. Just for the traffic of the dogs and us. Yeah, this will be so much cleaner and better for Gray, Gray with his allergies and stuff. Stuff. So I'm very excited. You, I think it's gonna look so good too. It is gorgeous. It's gonna be cold though. It's gonna be cold, but we are gonna get a big area rug, so it won't be too terribly cold. You can go stuff. show them the floor, and there's two pieces that are pulled out in the garage. Sitting I'll go show you over in the third cell. Ooh, my booty is swole. I We did a TikTok dance challenge thing yesterday and today and I am like really sore from it. Okay, so Ethan said 
two are pulled out here. This is, he's already made those. And, oh, here we are. Look at how pretty. I love it, you guys. Afternoon, and I need to show you guys the finished finished project. Don't mind the mess. Grayson's already taken advantage of having a hard floor in the basement with all of his cars. But there is the finished product. Actually, uh, <clears throat> cleaned up all the trim because there was a little bit of paint, like you know, a little paint seeps in under the tape when I repainted this, so cleaned up the trim, kind of restained some parts of it. This blue tape you guys see is us taking a look at what size rug we want. So Courtney just ordered a nine by 12 foot rug that's gonna tuck underneath the couch all the way back to there. And then it's gonna come all the way to that wall and across. It's gonna look gorgeous. So the only thing I have left to do I gotta order the transition pieces to go in between the different floors. That's the flooring in Courtney's room. But we are concerned about having it go different direction. But when the door's closed, you can't even tell. There we go. Can't even tell. But it turned out really good. Super happy with the finished product. Once I got past this part that you guys saw last night, then, but these were all the angled cuts that I had to do. Once I got past the edge of the stairs there, I was just back and forth flying. And then I had to do some custom cut little pieces, like two and a half inch strips inside there. So now I just have to get some caulking and just do like a waterproof caulking along that seam. Piper's not sure what she thinks about it. Oh, you got your ball? What's this? What's this? Come on. Drop it. You want it? Okay. I don't think she likes how slippery it is. What are you doing? You crazy kid. So that's the final product. Now next we're gonna be ripping this up and putting the Capitred product, which is gonna be the same color as this, the restored wood. And they're these capped treads that just slide into place. You cut them to fit. And then the same color risers that go up and then the Capitred all the way up. And she likes it so much Eliza. that we're gonna go, Hi. that we are gonna go up those stairs, most likely in the near future, and then all the way down the hallway. Because, and, and what? And in here we decided, not here. Not here, here. We're not gonna rip the tile up, I said no, no. But we're gonna replace this, I guess, too. And get another rug, probably a seven by 10 in here though. What? Smaller rug in there, seven by ten yeah. or a round one or something. Not, yeah. We just we love it. I the longer we've owned houses, this is our second home, but I hate carpeting. I like how comfortable it is, like in bedrooms, and that's the only place I really want to have it. Um, actually, in our master bedroom, I wouldn't mind doing that. This flooring in there well, and, and putting a big help. area rug around it, the bed. Yeah, it helps with like gray and he has allergies and stuff yeah and we've noticed especially when he's downstairs that he gets all sorts of sneezy rashy things yeah so 
hopefully this takes care of it. But it's an awesome product. But now I'm going to have to pay full price for it. Unless I can find it it's from my buddy at the house. Yeah. yeah. So. Nana's here. Huh? Nana's here. Nana's here. I hope you guys enjoyed, though.